Servus and a warm welcome. In Munich, the tents are already being dismantled, but for us, the Luxon product Oktoberfest is moving on to the next round. Today, it's all about lighting technology. With the Luxon mini server, all types of lighting technology can be controlled and automated. Especially in the commercial sector, the DADI bus technology has been established for many years. For many years, the DADI extension has been a solid part of Luxon's interface portfolio. Today, I am pleased to introduce you to DALI Air. DALI, which stands for Digital Addressable Lighting Interface, is an internationally standardized protocol for controlling lighting, especially in commercial and professional environments. Each DALI participant can be easily and quickly addressed and grouped together. The variety of DALI lights or ECGs is very large. Whether designer lights, warehouse lighting or stable lighting, there is actually a suitable light source for every area of application which can be controlled via the wired DALI bus technology. With the new DALI Air, we now offer a wireless interface for easy and quick integration of up to 10 DALI devices, significantly simplifying automation in existing projects, and all without changing the wiring. The advantages are clear. Stepless dimming functions and completely flicker-free. Broadcast mode to control multiple lights simultaneously. Automated lighting according to demand. Daylight control. Constant light control and much more. Let's take a closer look at the wiring of the DALI Air. The DALI 2 wire technology is usually laid parallel to the 230 volt in the same cable. The DALI Air is powered via the two wires, brown and blue, with 230 volts. The two remaining wires, black and gray in my case, are used for the data connection, which is not polarity bound by the way. This means it doesn't matter how the data lines are connected and DALI Air has an internal power supply which is also transmitted via the data line. An expensive DALI power supply is therefore not necessary. Due to the compact design, the DALI Air can be easily installed in a flush-mounted box or on a cable tray. The cable length can be up to 30 meters and 10 DALI devices can be taught in up to 16 groups. The DALI Air is officially DALI 2 certified. This means not only DALI actuators can be thought in, but also DALI sensors such as a motion detector or a button can now be integrated into the Luxon ecosystem in no time. DALI Air supports the DALI lamp type 0 to 8 and the DALI 2 instance types 1 to 4. The wiring can be carried out in bus, line, star and tree. Oh, and for all those who are now wondering whether this feature will also be available for the DALI extension in the future, I have good news. In the future, the equivalent in the switch cabinet, the DALI extension, will also be officially DALI 2 certified, thus also enabling the teaching of sensors. Even previously purchased DALI extensions will receive this feature via update, just without an official DALI 2 seal. One reason why DALI technology is so popular is that Unlike analog systems, it can provide feedback on the current status or error messages, for example. This complements perfectly with the home and building automation of Luxon, because with our feature set, we can visualize these important messages on the one hand and forward them to the responsible person via our notification features, whether via caller, mailer or push notification. But now let's look at the commissioning using the Luxon config. If the DALI Air is supplied with the operating voltage 230 volts and is in the delivery state, the commissioning mode is automatically activated. This is signaled by the red, green, orange flashing LED on the device and can now be found in the search dialog. If the LED flashes orange, the device has already been taught in once and no connection to the airbase can be established anymore. To reset the device to the learning mode, you have to briefly interrupt the power supply. If the DALI Air is now found in the search dialog, you can identify the device by simply marking it. The LED on the device starts flashing quickly. Now you still have to define the room and the installation location and then you can save the configuration in the mini server. Once the DALI Air has been successfully taught in, the DALI search can be started. In a new installation, the complete new installation checkbox must be activated so that all DALI devices are readdressed during the search. If the DALI extension is installed into an existing DALI installation, a normal search is sufficient to take over all DALI devices and their settings. Start the search with 
Start Search and all connected DALI devices not yet included in the programming are listed. Once the search is finished and you mark a device here, it identifies itself by making all outputs of the device pulsate. This way, you can assign and name the devices accordingly. Now, mark a device, choose designation, room and installation location and add them to the programming with a plus sign and save the configuration in the mini server. Done! If several DALI lights are to be controlled simultaneously, a DALI group is recommended. This has the advantage that the programming becomes clearer and there is no time delay when dimming the lights. When teaching the DALI devices, existing group assignments are loaded and created in Loxon Config. To create a new group, the individual DALI devices must already be taught in. In the properties of a group, the desired taught in devices can be selected and thus assigned to the group. Afterwards, the group actuator can be used in programming. In summary, the new DALI Air was developed to easily and quickly integrate DALI actuators and sensors using Loxon Air technology into the home and building automation of Loxon without laying any new cables. Now, we wish you a lot of fun realizing future projects and if you like this video, as always, we're looking forward for a thumbs up and to ensure you don't miss any new products, I recommend you subscribe to our YouTube channel because next week we will continue with the next innovation. See you next time.